Hello everyone, we have your given exponential equation. x to the power of 2 to the power of x equals 6,561. And in this video, we'll be solving for the value of x. And so how are we going to solve this kind of equation? What do you think will be the best way to do it? Okay, let's do it this way. First, we focus on the constant right-hand side of the equation. 6,561. If you take a look at the digits, this number is actually divisible by 3, right? Did you notice that? It is because the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. Since uh, 6 plus 5 is 11, plus 6, 17, plus 1 is 18. So it is divisible by 3, since 18 is divisible by 3. So in this kind of equation actually, all we have to do is uh, convert this uh, constant right here on the right into an exponential form. So since this number is divisible by 3, then we'll be getting its factor, right, in terms of 3. And convert it into exponential form. So from here, we start dividing by 3. All right. So 6,561 divided by 3, that is 2,187. And divide by 3 again, that will be... 729 and keep keep dividing by 3 and here we keep dividing by 3 then 9 divided by 3 is 3 so that's the last factor of that 6561 now let's start counting the factors 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so here the equivalent uh, exponential form of 6561 is 3 to the power of 8 that's in exponential form. Now let's go back to our equation. So now the equation can be written as x to the power of 2 to the power of x equals 3 to the power of 8. So from here, we'll be taking the natural logarithm on both sides of the equation. So this is now ln of x to the power of 2 to the power of x equals ln of 3 to the power of 8. Now we're taking down the exponent. The same thing on here. So the equation now becomes 2 to the power of x times ln or natural logarithm of x equals 8 becomes the coefficient. So 8 times ln of 3 or natural logarithm of 3. And so from this point, if you notice, can we equate this one, 2 to the power of x, to 8? And uh, natural logarithm of x to natural logarithm of 3? You sure can, right? Or shall I say, by uh, direct comparison, we can have this compared to that. And ln of x compared to or equated to ln of 3. We can have 2 to the power of x is equal to 8. And the other one, natural logarithm of x is equal to natural logarithm of 3. And from here, on the left hand side, 2 to the power of x is equal to 8. Can be written the same way as 2 cubed. The base are the same. This means the exponent must be the same, right? So we can equate the exponent as now x is equal to 3. That's our answer. And considering the right hand side, ln of x is equal to ln of 3, it's very obvious that x is equal to 3, right? So x is equal to 3. That's the same as that. So that's the same answer right there. And so that's all for now. And for those new to my channel, I would appreciate it if you can hit the like button and subscribe for more interesting and informative videos. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching. I will see you on the next video. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.